house for that. There weren't any anchors and so they weren't staying, so. Someone goes, you don't look or act homeless and look and act like you're right where you want to be. I was like, I'm actually an actress. <laughs> <laughs> it's just fun. <laughs> but like, no. $1,800 for a one bedroom apartment, that's just not One, it's not like I could just go get a second, third, fourth job because I have days. Exactly. And like, it's crazy because it's like, people are like, oh, you can afford this and this and this and this. It's like, yeah, that's like half the price of rent. So you can yep. afford 600 bucks a month, but like add 1800 on top of that. The math just ain't math and homie. Like, I don't understand how people are just think they look so stupid. Yeah, they do. It's like, think before you speak. Good morning, guys. We're currently on our way to Sedona and Sorry. I've never been there before. She's gonna show me. She doesn't really act like she knows or she's been to Sedona either. We've been sitting here this entire time trying to find where we're going. A specific location in the middle of nowhere to be exact that I didn't have the location to, so I had to find it. We're officially en route. We literally just sat here for 15 minutes trying to find where we were going, but apparently it's like three, four inches of snow. We're wanting to the location scout so she can find where she's going for her elopement next, whatever, Saturday? Is that what you said? Next Saturday? So I've never been. It's a two hour drive from where we are. Basically that calls for a road trip, but because it's snowing, I don't have, or it snowed, I don't have any snow, snow boots. boots. Yeah, because I don't like the snow. I don't like the cold. I don't like anything. All I have is like a North Face jacket. So I'm wearing my docks, this hoodie that you guys see me wear every single day, and these sweats that you guys see me wear every single day. So, because they don't have snow boots. I have concrete boots. <laughs> I brought these. And um, because I'm afraid of getting stranded somewhere in the cold because I hate the cold. Let me show you what I brought. Wait, you actually brought like a go bag? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I was so confused when you said you brought a bunch okay. of stuff. Okay, so we've got Tylenol. <laughs> we've got two things of chargers. One for your phone, one for this camera battery in case we need to document our our documentary. I know um, you brought a survival kit. <laughs> yeah, I brought the check for me just in case <laughs> one or the other dies. I brought pads because I'm on my period. Go figure. We have our wallet. Let's see what we have in here. Oh, I got SD cards in case our documentary gets too long. <laughs> we got chapstick in case it gets too cold. Oh. We got some Tylenol and some cash. <laughs> we got some cash. I didn't want to bring a whole hiking bag. I don't hike. Two hours there, two hours back. It's a road trip. Let's go. snacks we already ate but i'm like a little hungry but i want like something healthy i don't want junk food i don't think i'm gonna find that here no i don't think i'm gonna find that here i don't want junk food maybe i do all right well that was a fail i did not find the fruit that i wanted so we're just gonna go to our hike and then we'll starve from sweating and then we'll come back and get some food which sounds like a better plan anyways because I just still feel so bloated and gross and dehydrated. Cheers. <laughs> I want to go four wheeling so bad, or one of, in the, one of those pink pink jeeps. We're literally on the road. Brooke. <laughs> I feel like it's this way, and I'm only saying this way because it looks easier to walk. Uh. <laughs> well, that's what we need. We need those sticks. We could always ask somebody too if they've been on the route before. Yep. 
Needless to say, we did not come prepared. We did not come prepared. We are slipping and sliding, gliding and almost flying. Oh my gosh, look at these. Do you see those? Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. I'm out of breath. She doesn't know how to wait. Well, at least we'll be going down an incline. Every time snow falls, I think it's an animal. Yeah, they need some benches for us. There aren't any benches. <laughs> there aren't any benches. <laughs> Is that what you said? <laughs> it looks like we've made it, folks. It's so pretty. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you don't. You don't. It's kind of hard to like, find the path. Come on, little chicken. <laughs> Speed it up. <laughs> no, you're good. I'm ready. Okay. But are breadsticks okay? Yeah. Okay. Perfect. Because I wanted. Do they have root beer? Yeah, they do have root beers. Two root beers. Two beers. Really? It's popular yeah. right now. We're starving. We were gonna um, eat somewhere in Sedona, closer to where we were, but everything is so expensive. So. Yeah, we're still in Sedona, but we're not like close to where we were, like where oh, all the shots yeah, were. Yeah, you guys Hi. ready? We're ready. Right. So, we're each gonna do a root beer. Oh, let me go grab some. We drove like 15 minutes out to this cute little Italian place. It's either Italian or pizza. No, it's Italian. Anyways, I'm starving. I'm so hungry. What did we have? Oh, we had that little bagel sandwich earlier, but I sweated that out. <laughs> all right, two root beers. I'm gonna do mine with chicken. Oh, you're doing it too? Not shrimp? Perfect. You can get your root beers right out. Thank you. Let's see what kind of root beer this is. You know what my favorite one is? Mug. I thought you meant your favorite brand of root beer. Yeah, kind of. I feel like we're on a date. <laughs> cream First soda. First date, kind of nervous. <laughs> Might delete later. Yeah, cream oh. soda. Cream soda is my favorite. Okay, Let's see how good these breadsticks are. These are like a 10 out of 10, but I could also just be starving. <laughs> got back from um, hanging out with Kaylee. I'm like looking at the count go up for subscribers. It's just, guys, we're about to hit 100K. 100K. 100,000, look at this. I'm literally gonna cry. <laughs> Days, we're doing it. I'm just watching these numbers and I'm, I'm just, I'm at a loss. I'm at a, I'm, I have no words sitting here and I literally cannot believe it. I- Look at this! Look at this! Look at this! Are. You. Kidding. Me. What is happening? What is happening? Oh my gosh. Thank you guys. Thank you. We're doing it! We did it, Asian boy! We're doing it! Like, we haven't even- we haven't even hit it yet, and I'm I'm literally freaking out. We're freaking out. I have every camera that I could find set up right now to get it in all angles for all platforms. Look at this. We have a thousand left. We have a thousand left. We have a thousand left. Possible. Now I'm having heart populations. Oh my gosh, okay, it's happening. It's actually happening. Three, two, four, five. 77.
boy what the heck just happened <laughs> like I don't have words <laughs> I remember making my vision board a few videos back and putting it at putting it at like the top now I'm like it was probably really far away but like still having hope that like it's still possible and um, <laughs> I literally just prayed and prayed just not even to make it that fast but just like that it would come eventually if it was God's will. Like I was literally homeless last year this time. And I never, ever, ever imagined being where I am today and having the community and support that we do. I'm so grateful and so thankful for each and every single one of you. Like I just don't understand. <laughs> like I just don't understand. This is absolutely insane. We literally did it together. We did it, dude. <laughs> we freaking did it. We did it. I wish I had more words and I'm lost of words once again. I have no idea. Dude, how did we do that? <laughs> he loves you. <laughs> that was so cute, Dace. <laughs> that was so cute. God is good and God is literally a miracle worker and he makes the impossible possible and that is just it. All glory to God, seriously. Like, I wish I could hug every single one of you and I wish you guys could feel our gratitude that literally happened overnight. I could say thank you and thank you and thank you and thank you a million times and it would still never be enough. I just hope you guys know how, how much you are loved by the both of us. We just can't thank you enough for being here, joining us, watching our journey, supporting our journey, loving us through our journey, encouraging us and inspiring us to keep going every single day. And I know we're not homeless anymore and we haven't been for like four months, but the healing process is still super hard and um, you guys have made it a million times easier. You guys are loved, you guys are valued, you guys are deserving, you guys are worthy. We love you, Jesus loves you, and um, thank you again.